Welcome back folks to Tracer Digital. Today we're fixing the error of Uplay R164 point DTR missing. If you're experiencing issues with the Uplay R164 point DLL file which is associated with Ubisoft's Uplay platform, you can try several methods to fix the problem. Here are some steps to help you resolve the issue. One. Reinstall Uplay. The most straightforward solution is to reinstall the Uplay client. This can often resolve the issue with missing or corrupted DLL files. And here's how to do it. Go to your settings, go to apps, look for Ubisoft Connect and then click on install. And then visit their website and download the latest version of the Ubisoft Connect application on your Windows. Install it, follow the steps, and see if the problem persists. 2. Run a System File Checker The System File Checker tool can help you identify and repair corrupted or missing system files. And here's how to use it. Press Windows plus S and search for Command Prompt. Right click on it and choose Run as an Administrator. In the Command Prompt window, type the following command, sfc slash scan now. The tool will scan your system for corrupted files and attempt to re repair them. 3. Update graphics drivers Sometimes graphic driver issues can lead to DLL errors. Ensure your graphic drivers are up to date by visiting the manufacturer's website. 4. Check for malware Malware infections can sometimes interfere with system files. 5. Restore a backup If you have a backup of your system that was created before you encountered the DLL issue, you can try restoring it to your system. This can help you revert the system to the state where the DLL file was intact. And of course, if none of the methods work and you believe the issue is related to Ubisoft's Uplay client, consider contacting Ubisoft support for assistance. They may have specific solutions or updates to address the problem. You can also download the file manually from the sites and then install it into the file into the game file directory. Thank you guys for watching. I hope this video was helpful. Please don't forget to like and subscribe and see me on the next video with a new tutorial.